Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to do like a pair, compare and contrast on these two mascaras. The first one is LA Curve and then the second one is my favorite which is Great Last. So if you're excited to see the results then keep on watching. All right, y'all. So first things first, I actually already did and prep my face. Let's put this behind my ear like that. Already like did like a light beat on my face. I uh, did my brows. I conceal up under this just so you can get like an idea on like a semi full face. All right. So first things first on the left side, we're going to do the LA, LA color mascara. And I have some thoughts on this. You heard me talk about it briefly in some videos, but in this video, I'm going to give you, you know, the whole thing. And if you hear any noise, I am washing. <laughs> okay. Again, so this is the LA Color Mascara. And then on the right side, we are going to use my all-time favorite, Great Last Mascara. And then look at, I didn't show you the Brussels. Okay, this is actually smaller. Alright, so let's start with that as well. Look at this brush on the LA Color Mascara. And then look at the brush on the Great Lash. And I feel like the last time I got, got it, I don't think the brush wasn't as, this wasn't as, was not as small as it is on this, this time around. So I like that because you can really get into the crevice, especially on to the lower lash line okay I'm trying to think if I need I'm gonna get like another coat oh wow Alright, let me see if I'm going to add another coat to the Great Lash. Once again, this is Great Lash and then this, I mean, this is LA Color and then this is Great Lash. Okay. Alright, so first things first, let's start with LA Color. Okay, so this one, the one that I got, it says it's volume, volume, Volumizing Mascara. Alright, so don't look at this one. This is the Volumizing Mascara one. I personally don't really see the Volumizing. Volumizing meaning it's supposed to be really, you know, your eye is going to really pop, right? I mean, I see it, but at the same time, I feel like, I feel like it could be more. Um, and I just, I don't know. When I first used it, I wasn't that much of a fan of it. And now using it, I see a volumizing, but again, I feel like it should be more. It should definitely pop your eye as soon as you put it on, I feel. But then again, this was only a dollar at Emily Dollar, so you get what you pay for. Moving on to Great Lash. This is like my favorite and until I find like another mascara that I want to try out, this will probably be the one that I'll be using, you know, until I want to switch up. So this is Great Lash and I feel like you can really see how my eye is popping. And I use two coats of this and with even with one coat, you can definitely see a difference. But look at it. I feel like you can really see 
you know you can tell like oh my goodness now without even like telling y'all which one is my favorite which i don't think i did yet which one do you do you like or prefer or have you even tried either one of them if you have a totally different one that you have tried leave them down below in the comments now once again the left side is la curve la curve and then the right side is great lash so let me know which one you like or like i said if you have tried something totally different then let me know in the comments below but my favorite one so far is the great lash curve mascara for one i like this one oh this is waterproof look listen more um pros this is also waterproof this one anyway i don't know i think there are all certain ones that you have to look listen i just seen that it said great lash and i got it but um and i didn't even know until just now that it was waterproof but i don't know if all of them are waterproof or is it just certain ones so make sure you pay attention to that if you want a waterproof mascara but i also love like you don't have to use two coats for your if if i'm looking away i'm looking into my mirror but you don't have to use two coats to notice how defined your um your lashes are you can easily use one coat and you can use like a one thin coat it does not have to be thin. you don't have to coat like every lash in my opinion to see the effect of it but I love that on this one the brush the bristle is so small that you can get into the crease and the crevice especially onto the lower lash line I love that now with the great lash I feel like it's kind of similar to uh, any other mascara wand with the curving now i do see the curving and i don't know if you can tell i do see the curve into the one however with with the lash you know you can't really tell that much of a volumizing i feel like you have to use several coat coats in order to get it to where you want it to be and that and then even then it probably won't stand out as how you would want it to be that's just my opinion but you feel free to do however you feel um but like like i said the coat or the wand is similar to any other wand it's it's very clumpy and i feel like it's good for like the top your top lashes your bottom lashes not too much only because you know your bottom lashes are tinier so you're going to need something smaller like this one to really get up in the crevice get in there and i also learned a trick uh, i was watching um somebody's video i think is I think it's nat natural oh i forgot her name but you want to like instead of putting it like that put it like this and it will really help volumize your lashes on your lower line so like i said hands down so far this is my favorite mascara the great lash unless i find something else um after i like use this up unless i find something else that i want to try or if you've tried something besides these two and you want to let me know in the comments then feel free and if you have tried these two which ones do you like which ones do you want don't like let me know in the comments below so once again these are the mascara looks I feel like LA Color is really trying to show out on this eye because I'm doing a review on it. So it's like really trying to pop. I don't know. You can you can kind of see my lashes like popping some. But I don't know. I feel like I still feel like the Great Lash is doing a better job of allowing my lashes to pop more. But like I said, y'all let me know what y'all think. 
but as always thank you all so much for watching for joining in and just being a part of the fun make sure you are subscribed make sure you hit that notification bell and as always y'all what do i say hold your head up high why because she walks in beauty bye y'all